Hey there, welcome back to my channel. So this is my first video for the new year, my first haul for the new year, so I'm super excited. Um, as usual, I always like to quickly talk to you guys before I get straight into the haul. So, just to give you an overview, an overlook of what this month looks like, this is a low, low budget month for us. I think this is the smallest haul we have ever done. And so we're kind of going to do this experiment to see how long we can make these groceries last. We want to stretch these groceries as far as possible. And so that is our goal for this month with our haul with Costco and Walmart. Now, I just want to kind of just reflect on our shopping experience. We got hit with a pretty big snowstorm here in our area. So that really impacted the stock level in a lot of the stores that are in my area, as well as the normal food shortage. And then of course, I'm noticing for sure this time, the price increase on a lot of things. Now, we order our groceries through Instacart and through the Walmart app. And with Instacart, their markup prices also have has increased. So um, that's just a lot of things to keep in mind for those who um, are watching these type of videos to get some ideas of what to do, how to budget themselves as a large family or doing a, a larger haul or whatever the case may be. It's just the whole overall shopping experience lately hasn't been the greatest. Um, I will insert a couple of photos from um, the pictures that my Instacart shopper actually shared with me showing me that there was a lot of things that wasn't in stock. <music> But through the grace of God, we are thankful and grateful that we were able to get um, a bulk of the things that we needed and the most important items. So we have a few different um, varieties of stores in our area that we can go to um, just in case we need a particular item at a particular moment and we don't want to place another Instacart or Walmart order. Um, but I think that's basically it, guys. Um, I'm sorry if I look exhausted because I am. I'm sorry if I look sweaty because I am. Um, I am officially in my third trimester. And so um, that's part of the reason why we are doing these lower budget hauls because we need to try to accumulate some baby items before baby arrives. Um, this time of the year is really um, unfortunate for a lot of families. Um, people are getting laid off, people are not getting the hours they need and so forth. And that has impacted our family at the moment. So my husband is home. So our budget really for this month, I think was about $1,300. Um, and we can't go over that. So we'll see how much I spent in total. I can't remember. Um, because there was a lot of items that weren't available in our Instacart shoppers had to refund us back a lot of those items. So um, I'm going to have to update you guys and let you guys know, um, did those refunds affect us? Did those missing items affect us and so forth? Um, but yeah. Before we get into the haul, I just want to quickly show you guys um, a bump update. So this is my bump. This is what I'm looking like at 28 weeks and um, four days. So we are getting close to the end. And yeah, baby's getting heavy. Okay, so for snacks, a part of our snacks for our kids this month, we bought the school safe. Um, they're like little muffin cake sort of things. And so there's the birthday cake, which is one of the most popular ones in our house. And then there's the banana chocolate chip. And there's 20 of these bars that come in a box. Down here, we have the 72 pack of Eggos. And this has become a part of our monthly hauls. 
my kids really enjoy it. They like to put um, strawberry jam, cream cheese, Nutella. They like to experiment with different things. So this is a big hit in our house. This month I decided to um, get this little pack of Laughing Cow cream cheese just to go with some crackers that I bought this month. We bought two packs of the 30 um, containers of uh, the large white eggs. There's two of those, so that makes 60 eggs. I bought one pack of the three individual packs of the Dempster's white breads. Usually we buy two, but uh, this month we just bought one. I bought some garlic toast to go on the side with some um, spaghetti this month on the menu. And there's 24 slices that come in this pack. I bought some of the Kirkland beef wieners. Um, there's three individual packs that come in um, this three pack together. And there's 12 wieners that come in each pack. Just bought one pack of stewing beef for this month to make some stewed beef. There's two packs of um, Natrell chocolate milk and there's 16 individual bottles that come in each pack. I bought three packs of juice boxes this month. This is the Rougemont juice boxes. There's 40 that come in there and there's apple juice flavor, peach, fruit punch, and apple berries. Um, we tried these for the first time, I think, last month, and I, we really enjoyed it. So I bought another pack. This is the Olay Ultra Moisture Shea Butter Body Washes, and there's three that come in a pack. Now, I really like this, and this lasts really long. I think we still have, like, a bottle left from our last haul. It is a thicker body wash, so my kids can't be like, oh, pour out a whole bunch when I go to take a shower. Um, a little goes a long way and it smells great keeps your body nice and moisturized so I do recommend this we have the Dove hand soaps I also think I bought this for the first time last month and um, there's four that come in this pack there's the original Dove scent here and then there's the uh, cucumber and green tea scent here. Last month, this was actually pretty expensive. I think it was like almost $17 for this. This month, we got a really good deal. I think it was like 8 or $9, which was a really good deal to me. So, um, and we still have a whole bottle left from our last haul. So these two moisturizing items, I recommend because they last a long time. We have just two boxes of the Lay's Variety Packs of chips. So in, in total, that's 100 individual bags of chips. And that's the flavors that come in those boxes. I just bought one pack of Yolp. And this is uh, a 15 pack of the Yolps. And there's strawberry banana vanilla and strawberry flavors that come in this pack this month i decided to buy all our milk from costco so this is uh i think there's four one two three and four yes and there's three individual bags that come in each of those bags i bought two boxes of the rougemont apple juices and there's six that come in a pack so that's 12 in total. And um, I've gone back to drinking this for myself. I can finally stomach it. And so this is for mommy. Um, we have just a two pack of Nutella over here. That's one kilogram for each container. So that's two in total. These my husband and I really enjoyed. This is the one kilogram pack of the Jane battered fish and um there's about 12 or 15 individual pieces that come in here and so i'm really loving this this pregnancy so i had to buy it again and i think it was on sale this time so i was happy about that 
my kids love cheese it especially my littlest ones so there's um a pack or a box of cheese it here and there's two bags that come in this box so what i'll do is i'll just uh pack them into individual ziploc bags when they request them for snack and that way everybody has a fair share and nobody's fighting <laughs> They still didn't have the individual goldfish packs available at my local Costco, so we bought this one back again. And same thing with the Cheez-Its. I'll just put them into little individual uh, Ziploc bags at snack time if they request this. And um, just leave it as that until they bring back the individual packs of the goldfishes. Here are the crackers that I was talking about. So I will spread the Laughing Cow cream cheese on these crackers. And of course, we'll use them for other things like tuna and crackers and so forth. Um, but this is a hit in my house. So that's a box of those. And then I just bought these fruit gummies. They're 68 that come in a box. And this will be added to my kids' snacks for the month. And then there's this big bag of trail mix. If you're not new here, you guys know that we usually buy the box of trail mix. Those weren't available at our local Costco this time. So our Instacart shopper um, just substituted it for this big old bag. <laughs> and I don't know um, if it's worth it or not. My husband and my boys are just going to have to pack them into individual uh, Ziplocs when they want them. Um, but yeah. We have 10 packs of the Cottonelle Flushable Wipes. Now, last month, we actually ran out of these. I don't know what happened. I don't know how. That was the first time we ever ran out of Flushable Wipes. So, I'm going to try again this month to see how long this lasts us. Hopefully, we don't need to go and bump up and buy two boxes because this thing, even though it is amazing to have, the kids all have nice fresh bums after they use the washroom, it is pretty expensive. So if I'm going to have to start buying two boxes of these guys, I don't know. I don't know. We just have this 32 pack of Canada Dry and my husband will enjoy this for the month. I have this 18 pack of Huggies Natural Care um, Wipes. And then just this box of pull-ups for my two-year-old. This is 128 pack, sizes two to three T. And this will definitely last us the month. Then I have just three packs of 40 um, that come in each case of the Kirkland Waters. And we stacked up on a lot of water this month. Um, water is the best thing for us right now. So yes, we bought three of those. And that completes our Costco haul for this month. Guys, this is the smallest Costco haul I've ever done. So I'm very curious to see how long this is going to last us. Walmart just arrived, so I'm going to sort out all this Costco stuff. And then I will be back to show you what we bought at Walmart. So stay tuned for part two of this haul. So this is what we bought this month at Walmart. So I'm just going to quickly just go through everything because this mama is tired. Here we just have four um, packs of hot dog buns for hot dogs on the menu this month. They didn't have any heads of lettuce, so I just bought two pre-shredded iceberg packs of lettuce. We have some vegetable oil this time. Um, they didn't have any other the canola oil or any of the other ones, so we got vegetable this time. I just have three of these Dempsters, just the original um, bagels this time. We usually buy our cream cheese from Costco, but they didn't have any available at our local Costco. So I bought um, four of these, the Philadelphia original cream cheese, and this is a 340 gram container of cream cheese. We go through a lot of cream cheese in my house. Um, there is some Swiss cheese here i actually asked for mozzarella and they didn't have any so they substituted it for the swiss just a pack of pasta here um this recently just had um a price increase these pastas used to just be like 97 cents at walmart so there's a little bit of an increase there i bought two containers of the great value cream cheese and this is just um, the 500 milliliter 
container of those. And we usually buy, I can't believe it's not butter margarine, but they didn't have any. So um, we just got the Imperial this time. I just have this small package of great value mixed vegetables. And I usually just put that in like fried rice or something. We just have this three cheese um, blend of shredded cheese. This will put on top of potatoes this month. And then I just have two of the Tex-Mex shredded cheese for tacos this month. This is a substitution. Usually we just buy the regular butterball turkey bacon, but this is the low sodium or re salt reduced version of it. And there's two packs of those. I bought two boxes of Captain Crunch cereal this month, two boxes of Honeycomb, and two boxes of Reese's Puffs. Here we have eight regular ground beef packs, and honestly, with a tight budget, this is a recommendation for me. If you can pick this up because they're really cheap. Um, then I would recommend that you get this. There's so many different dishes that you can make with ground beef, um, especially if you want to stretch for a large family. Um, so there's eight of those, but I'll probably pick up some more sometime um, next month. Last month, I didn't get any chicken breasts from Walmart, so I'm so happy to see that they brought um, back stock of the chicken breasts. Um, there's about one, two, three, four, five, six, about seven or eight pieces that come in these packs and I bought two of those. I just have one jar of great value mayonnaise, two bottles of the Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce here. This is our favorite barbecue sauce. Um, my husband loves peppermint tea and usually he just gets um, I think it's one of the Walmart brands, Peppermint Teas. They didn't have it. So the, my Instacart shopper just substituted it for the Tim Hortons Peppermint Tea. So I don't know how these taste. I will let you know once my husband gives that a try. Um, we have two containers of Parmesan cheese. I don't know how long this is going to last us because we usually buy the big bottle from Costco. But Costco didn't have any, so I just bought two of these parmesan cheese which is 250 grams each a few canned items here there's two cans of just dark red kidney beans um they didn't have the regular ones so my instacart shopper substituted them for the no salt added version of them i have three cans of um great value evaporated milk i have a can of great value chickpeas here um my husband makes a really good chenna. I don't know if my West Indians um, will know what chenna is, but um, I was craving it, so I just picked up a quick can of Great Value Chickpeas. And I have two cans of the Great Value Peaches and Cream corn. I put corn in my um, mashed potatoes, so we have two of those. And then I just have five um, cans of sweetened condensed milk. I swear I bought six. But there's five here, so I'm going to have to go back and investigate what happened there. Um, we have here just three boxes of turnovers. I just picked up three bags of the Grace Green Plantain chips. So there's one, two, and three here. We have two bottles of maple syrup. I bought a package of um, just white sugar. That's just two kilograms. Of sugar we don't buy sugar very often so um, I think we only usually use sugar for tea anyways so this will last us quite some time I had requested four hard taco kits and four soft taco kits but they didn't have any soft so they only gave us the four of the old El Paso hard taco kits this month my kids requested um, some pudding and jello um, for desserts whenever we have desserts on certain nights so I will go through the flavors that we got okay so we have um, four packs of the snack pack jellos 
This is the raspberry and mixed berry version. So there's four of those. We have um, two packs of just the great value tapioca pudding version. Um, my eldest daughter rec or requested this. So this is her pick. We have three packs of the vanilla. And then three packs of the um, ice cream sandwich version of the pudding. And so this is what my kids had requested for dessert this month. And then we just have this 18 family pack of uh, wagon wheels. And that will just be added to their snacks for the month. Um, this pack of milk chocolate was in our bag. I don't know if it was our Instacart shoppers and she forgot it. Um, but I'm going to contact her and ask her or see if it's on my receipt. But that was a little surprise that was in one of our bags. And then on to just cleaning and hygiene products. I have a bottle of Tide here. Um, and that will go with what we have stashed away for laundry for the month. Just um, a three pack of palm olive dish soap. I usually get the great value sandwich bags, but they didn't have it. So they substituted it for the Ziploc version of it. And then I just have some Ziploc freezer bags for my meats and so forth. We have this 100 feet of great value aluminum foil. A three pack of toothpaste. Um, just a small bottle of some conditioner and um, some baby wash for my little ones. And my littlest one needed another um, toothpaste. And then just two um, deodorants to add to our um, hygiene closet. And then one pack of Swiffer pads. I requested something else and they didn't have it so they substituted it for this. These toilet papers were on sale. I was trying to see if I can get something that's more budget friendly. We usually buy our toilet paper from Costco, um, but we had requested something else and it wasn't available. So my Instacart um, shopper was really nice and she was trying to help me find the best deal. And so this is the Royale original brand and there's 20, 24 rolls, which are double rolls. So they're equivalent to a 48 pack of toilet paper and um this will last us the month and then we just have a box of pull-ups for my youngest son is 82 pack and it's uh four to five t and then i forgot to add this to what we had bought from costco it's just a pack of potatoes there and then we just have three cases of great value water to add to our water um, stock up supply so that's everything that we bought from Walmart this month now I knew I was missing some cans so I found the bag and all the clutter and mess that we have going on right now so there's the sixth great value sweet condensed milk there's two more of that um, chickpeas and then just three more cans of evaporated milk Okay, so I'm just going to quickly go through some items that I get from um, the Real Canadian Superstore. And then I also bought a few things um, from Dollarama that my husband just picked up because he was just in that area where Dollarama was. But anyways, okay. So we have some Always pads here, size 4. This is for my oldest daughter. And um, two of the Fruit Punch drink mix my kids like the fruit punch and the cherry so there's two of the cherry as well and then i bought peach for myself because i like to um just mix it in my cup put it in the freezer and just let it like get into like some slushified sort of formation and so um sometimes when i want something sweet i'll drink that and then we'll just we just have um a container of hot chocolate since it's super cold here I have this club size um, parboiled rice here and then this club size um, shredded coconut. My husband puts that on top of his porridge 
in the mornings. And then this is our favorite spaghetti sauces. So there's two, four, six of those. Sub Mrs. Dash seasoning. Um, I had requested a different version of coconut milk, but I didn't have it. And so our Instacart shopper substituted it for this brand. So there's two of those, and I just use this for when I make rice and peas. And then we also just bought this club size version of their frozen pancakes, buttermilk pancakes, and there's 24 that comes in there. But this is my first time trying these pancakes, so hopefully my kids like them because pancakes have been out of stock at Walmart lately. And so I picked up these. And then we just bought a cake <laughs> my husband wanted one this month so it's just a red velvet cheesecake and so that was just a special treat uh for this month so that's the stuff that i bought at the real canadian superstore and then at sobeys my husband thought i didn't buy any shredded coconut so he just picked up this um compliments version of shredded coconut and then lately we can only get cream of wheat from sobeys so my husband picked up that and since he was in that area he stopped by at the dollar store and our local dollar store is actually dollarama so these are a dollar 25 and um we bought three but we already opened up one and so i think we're going to start buying our garbage bags from the dollar store because it's just more budget friendly and then we picked up the black garbage bag version of it but there's only 10 that come in that box but like you, the prices are here like a dollar 25 um a dollar 25 so these are budget friendly and um i just asked my husband to pick up this small little toothpaste because i'm gonna throw this in my hospital bag and also um just one of these I'll probably throw in my hospital bag as well and one of these and so when I go into labor I'll just have a few of those items there to freshen my breath while I'm in the hospital and this is something my husband just picked up and um and then also this will go in my hospital bag I'll put one of my face bar soaps in here and so that's just a bunch of miscellaneous things that we bought on the side outside of our walmart and costco haul so that's everything that we purchased for this month i will leave the total that we spent for this month somewhere in this video um but like i said this is a low low budget month for us and um i will update you guys in the next video to let you know how we did in terms of what last what didn't last and so forth Thanks for watching today's video. I'll see you guys in the next one. And may the Lord keep and bless all of you guys. Bye.